we really don't have anything left. If this keeps up, our sales will come in at a loss. There'll be nothing left for us to do but starve. You know the decree. The rules are the rules. No discounts, no exceptions, and no excuses. Hmm? And who are you? Another new member of the association? It just so happens that we found your little ledger. So now we're here to tell everyone all about how you embezzled Crystal Marrow to sell it right back to the taxpayers. Huh? Is this true? You've been swindling us. Well, uh, you, you, you see, the, the ta taxes, uh... Let me take He's a breaking. look at the ledger. Well, would you look at that? Every payment the association has made is right here in your personal ledger. So, Mr. Keijiro, it seems you have some explaining to do. How shall we settle this, hmm? <laughs> So you think you can use this against me, do you? I it's quite obvious that I'm merely trying to earn a modest living for myself, like anyone else. Word has it that Samurai and the Commission place great importance on reputation and prestige. Though I'm sure Commission members won't blame you once word gets out. Huh? Is that a threat? Are you threatening me? No, not at all. I'm simply stating that it would be quite a pity if an illustrious gentleman such as yourself were to have their reputation tarnished. Uh, well, even if what you say is true, what do you suggest we do about it? I believe you still have a quantity of crystal marrow in your possession, correct? Perhaps that crystal marrow could be used as compensation for the recent tax hike, and us merchants could finally have some more breathing room. Is that it? <sighs> Do you have any idea the hoops I had to jump through to get the crystal marrow and keep it hidden? Ah, uh, fine. In that case, I'll send it over to you today. And not even an ounce of shame for his actions. So that's it? My shop's been closed for weeks now. I've even had to ask my friends to help bail me out. What about my losses? Come on, Harrison. We've already stuck a good deal here. I'm sick of being pushed around like this. I won't let him off so easily. Uh-oh. Harrison. Hey, what's all this racket? Does someone dare question the decree? Ah, Chief. You've arrived. What was all the commotion I heard just now? Oh, we were just discussing a minor tax issue. I do my utmost to lend them a helping hand, but they're never grateful. Oh. A helping hand? The only thing you're doing is stuffing your greedy pockets with our hard-earned wealth. I assure you that Hirage Shinsuke will hear of this. Oh, oh, and you dare to utter the commissioner's name. You outlanders have no respect for the rules. Seize the merchants. We will resolve this dispute back at headquarters. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is going in a bad direction. Gentlemen, gentlemen, come now. Is there any need for this? Okay, if there's a dispute he. to resolve, let's get a drink and talk it over. Who are you supposed to be? And why in my right mind would I join you for a drink? Ha! You never heard of the fixer? Context, by my Context. Here's my card. Huh. You're from the Yashiro Commission. Shh. Huh. Well, this is Kanjo Commission territory. However powerful the Yashiro Commission may be, you have no business meddling in Rito's affairs. <laughs> of course not, of course not. Still, perhaps you could show the young lady. What? I think these pics are appealed to us soon. What is this? Oh. of our clan some courtesy you wouldn't want your name showing up in a petition to the shogun would you that fan the shirasagi himegimi i don't need any trouble with her <sighs> okay let's forget all this it'll give us one less thing to worry about but chief enough we're leaving let's get dinner one day soon gentlemen my treat i insist uh, no response, huh? I suppose that bridge is well and truly burned then. Thank you so much, Toma. 
But I'm sorry your relationship with the Kanjo Commission had to suffer for our sake. <laughs> hey, hey, I was joking. It's a small price to pay, and you're more than welcome. If there's anyone you should be thanking, it's the Traveler. He's the one who found a way to turn things around. <sighs> if nothing else, I'm sure the tax collection Ashigaru will tread a little more carefully in the future. Shh, shh, not here. Too many people listening. <laughs> Let's move somewhere else. Oh boy, that was close. Where is Okay, just let me just check something because I. I should have set up this. Corruption seems rife in the Kanjo Commission. They truly are rotten to the core. <sighs> All right, time for me to answer your questions. What would you like to know? <laughs> Straight to the point. Let me reintroduce myself. I belong to the Kamisato clan of the Yashiro Commission on Narukami Island. I'm an attendant of the Shirasagi Himegimi. <sighs> You've been keeping your true identity a secret from us this whole time? So, the Yashiro Commission. Guessing that's another branch of the Tri Commission? Correct. The Kamisato clan is the head of the Yashiro Commission, who manage ceremonial and cultural affairs. I'd go into more detail on what exactly that covers, but I'm not even sure myself. I'm just someone who was fortunate enough to be taken in by the Kamisato clan. My role is to take care of the daughter of the clan, Kamisato Ayaka, also known as the Shirasagi Himigimi. Seems like she must be super famous in Inazuma, given the reaction of those guys just now. <laughs> oh, most definitely. She's graceful, dignified, and kind-hearted, too. The people of Inazuma quite adore Miss Kamisato. Her fame even somewhat eclipses that of her older brother, Kamisato Ayato, despite the fact that he's the current head of the clan. I suppose those who treat others with compassion earn themselves the same treatment in return. Miss Kamisato's situation certainly seems to attest to that. Take me, for example. I'm just an attendant, and yet she treats me as an equal, as she would a friend. You're asking the right questions, and to be honest, I don't want to keep you in the dark any more than is necessary. Firstly, you should know that being a fixer is not something you can fake. I spent the better part of a month tirelessly building up a network of relationships on the island, and I got to know Captain Beto during that time, too. Still pretty good going for just a month's work. <laughs> well, maybe I have a slight knack for schmoozery. But the main thing was, I had to make sure I'd be in time to receive you when you arrived. Inazuma may have closed off to the outside world, but that hasn't stopped a lot of people from hearing about your feats in Monsta and Miyue. So, when Miss Kamisato heard of your intention to come to Inazuma, she began looking forward to your arrival with great anticipation. She's excited to find out whether the rumors are true. That is, that you have what it takes to change the tide of the times. Change the tide of the times? In the test I gave you earlier, although there were a few hiccups at the end, it was you who found the way to turn the situation around. Navigating powerful people, using their character flaws to your advantage, it's just what Miss Kamisato had hoped to see. With your help, even the Vision Hunt Decree... I feel... Uh, hmm. That's an unexpected development. Perhaps our sources were misleading. I have the only mission, or two. To pull while in the banner when she comes, and to find my sister. Yes, of course. I completely understand, and as agreed, I shall help set that up for you. Ah, <sighs> Toma sure didn't put up much of a fight. <laughs> well, my work on Rito is done. So I suppose this is goodbye for now. Oh, uh, one more thing. This invitation letter is for you. When you get to Narukami Island, you can find me at the Komori Tea House, as per the letter. Good luck with everything. See you soon. Toma's no 
not such a bad guy, huh? Huh, we should get going. My dear's what, what, Momo? Huh? What's up? Oh. oh, right! Paimon forgot all about that! Wait, so... Did Toma forget that too? Oh, darn it! No wonder he was so matter-of-fact about the whole thing! As soon as we get off Ritu, Paimon's going straight to Kimura Tea House to settle the score! Tea House? <sighs> Well, guess we should give it a try. Let's head to the border and see how far we get. Should I close my eyes? Where's the... Oh, I can I engage it? Why in the world can't I use my permit? Stop there. Present your travel permits. Sorry, but we really gotta get to Narakami Island. It's kinda urgent. If you don't have a travel permit, this is as far as you'll get. Those are the rules. <sighs> as expected. Traveler, you gotta think of something. How do we get out of Rito? I kind of conf already confused with this name. Are you saying we should go and meet with the Kanjo Commissioner? Guess it can't hurt to try. Even if Paimon has a few choice words to say about his subordinates. Who knows? Maybe he's our biggest fan. <laughs> Wait, Rana or Ayaka? Okay, well... Halt! This is the Kanjo Commissioner's office. No trespassers. We are here to see, uh, you know, um, the Kanjo Commissioner? The Kanjo Commissioner seldom entertains outlanders. Leave now or we'll be forced to... Ah, wait, wait, wait. Oh, Commissioner! These two are honored guests from afar. No need to give them the usual spiel. Hmm, come on in. Let's see what we can do for you. Huh! Did you get all that, mister? M m my sincere apologies! I think we're gonna meet up with Tayaka. I am Hiragi Shinsuke, Kanjo Commissioner and Head of the Hiragi Clan. It's an honor to meet you both. Hey there. Oh my god. I'm gonna go with this. Sir? So, the reason we wanted to come and see you was because... All right, all right, all in good time. Two travelers renowned far and wide have shown up to see me, and I should very much like to make their acquaintance. Let's not limit this to business only. <laughs> so what you're saying is, we really are pretty famous, huh? Mostly me. Absolutely. How many other people in the world have what it takes to knock the wind out of Storm Terror's sails and put the Overlord of the Vortex back under the sea, eh? Exactly! Paimon thinks you make an excellent point. Okay. And I hear you also foiled a Fatui plot in Liyue Harbor. Even beat one of their harbingers in a duel. Is that true? Whoa! You heard about that too? Uh, yep. It's true, all right. Hmm. As I thought. Something wrong? <laughs> no, no, no. I'm simply awestruck by you both, is all. Rito is greatly honored to have you visit us. One other thing I heard about you is your great zeal for helping other people. Hmm. 
This makes me wonder whether you might be so kind as to render your assistance to the Condro Commission. Oh, sure, no problem. Whatever you need, right? Time to run some errands again. Like, they are so aware of this. Excellent. Well, then. You must know the Qingxin. A flower grows on the mountaintops of Liyue. Yep, we've picked a few of those before. So, uh, you want us to go back to Liyue? Uh-oh. Yes, bring me 300 Qingxin, would you? Freshly picked, I mean. What? Uh, did Paimon hear that wrong? Hmm? Too much trouble, is it? Then how about this? We have a few items that need delivering. Perhaps you can help with that? That sounds much more like it. 709 letters, to be precise. Those hey, people! What gives? How come you don't have people to do that already? Terribly sorry. We're just a little short on people lately. What sort of an explanation is that? Is that cutting? Traveler, what are we going to do? Should we really help this guy? That's the spirit. Don't keep me waiting too long now. <laughs> You're seriously considering taking this job? The terms are ridiculous! So he's gonna be the side quest of the... Let me... Where did he go? Cat and where did he go? <laughs> Gonna say that for sound effects like when I... I mean, I'm still amazed of this game. That is a free but so high much quality. Halt you two! What now? Miss Hiragi has a letter for you. She insists that you read it immediately. A letter? Oh. Quick! Let Paimon see! So this means she wants you to secretly meet her at night? But you didn't seem surprised at all by this. What's going on? <laughs> huh? Have you been up to something behind Paimon's back? Tonight and see what she has to say. Huh. And are we supposed to come to this early? Yeah. And we unlock the thing. And we are Elector! Okay, let me see. Take this! What was Ah, you finally arrived. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Hiragi Chisato. Oh. This is technically the second time we have met. It's a pleasure to see you again. Wow. She's the daughter of the Hiragi clan, all right. No need to be so formal. I've long marveled at your accomplishments. And at last, we have the chance to meet. Is that Paimon, or does something seem a bit off here? Yep. The reason why I wanted to secretly meet you here is... Well, I feared that I might never have another opportunity to discuss this with you. Discuss what? Yeah, what? Ahem. 
I should like to ask for your help with delivering a letter. I'm really I see. Look at his face. <laughs> oh, he had this cat. Oh, boy. Uh, like father, like daughter. Couldn't you be more original? No, you misunderstand me. Please, allow me to explain. I was hoping that you could deliver a letter to Narukami Island in my stead. It is to be given to Kujo Kamaji of the Tenryo Commission. My father has always forbidden me from communicating with him. He knows that there are prospects for my marriage that would better serve him politically. But my heart is with Kamaji. There is no one who would dare defy my father's will on Rito, but you are outlanders. Outlanders seeking to get to Narukami Island. It would be regrettable to let such an opportunity pass. Paimon gets the whole picture now. Of course, in doing so, I will also do everything in my power to help you leave Rito. That is my promise. To be perfectly honest, as long as you remain in Inazuma, my father will have no intention of letting you leave Rito. Yeah, we figured as much. It was pretty obvious he was just trying to hold us up here. I secretly overheard a conversation between my father and a very arrogant sounding woman just a few days ago. They seemed to be discussing how to keep you here on Rito. In fact, it was the first time I had ever heard my father speak so respectfully to someone who wasn't the Shogun. We don't have much time. I'll tell you my plans to help you off the island. It just so happens that a shipment of goods is... Very well. I'll be waiting for you at the border. I'm counting on you to deliver my letter. Uh, so far, you was tuck, 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 tuck. I cannot, I cannot get tired. Hold on, please. These goods are being sent to Watatsumi Island? My lady, this is an unexpected honor. Uh, you are correct. These goods have been repeatedly requested by the Kanjo Commissioner. We must be certain that they reach Watatsumi Island intact. Is there something wrong, Lady Hiragi? No. As you were. My father simply has some concerns of the shipment's safety, and has ordered that myself and an additional qualified escort be dispatched to ensure safe transport of the goods. My lady, you aren't suggesting that you intend to escort the shipment personally, are you? There's certainly no need for you to trouble yourself with such a matter, and as for this qualified escort... Please, do not cause us any further delay. If memory serves me right, my father has already asserted that this shipment must arrive on time. I'm certain punishment will be duly dispensed if it fails to do so. Yes, of course, my lady. It, it's just that, well, we don't know who this... Now, need I remind you of the penalty if anything were to happen to me en route? I'm sure you are all quite familiar with my father's temperament. Do you really presume that you can fully guarantee my safety on your own? Boy, Chisato can talk the talk. They don't stand a chance. Yep. Uh, uh, yes, my lady. Very well, then. It, it's an honor to have you accompanying us. Your safety is our highest priority. Shinojo, you can't really be agreeing to this. Well, the request is from Lady Hiragi herself. It is our duty to serve her in the utmost capacity. Okay, yes, come on, boys. Let's go. That's not the problem here. Well then, if we're through here, I suggest we set off at once. Dawdling will only allow potential thieves more time to prepare, no? Yes, my lady. You heard her? There's no time to lose. I need to get to fight. He's gone. Although it could have been nice to have an NPC like stay in there. Okay, let's see the... Jeanette. My lady, please stay back. We'll handle it. Not as well as we'll handle it. Teamwork is teamwork. Whoa, why <laughs> the blitz? Uh, Over here. Uh, picked, picked the wrong, the wrong subject. subject. 
Monster sight. Prepare to counterattack. Protect Lady Hiroki at all costs. Oh, this is cool. Take care of this. Stay with Chisato. Hey, what? What is this? Oh, finally. Watch out! More monsters inbound! Lady Hiraki, stay close! Oh, someone! Go in! Move! Boom! Take this! Fall before you! Yeah! Oh, I wonder what is this? We can take refuge in the village up ahead. How are you faring, my lady? I'm perfectly all right. You may stop here. The road to Narukami Island is just over there. In my letter, I've requested Kamaji to grant you a special travel permit from the Tenryo Commission. Consider it a token of my appreciation. Nothing not suspicious here. My lady. Huh. So that's how it is. I, I had a feeling something was amiss, but Shinojo, you... No, Lady Hiragi would never hide anything from us, I'm sure of it. But who is this Kamaji you speak of, my lady? I'm not afraid to say that he's the one I love. The one you love? Uh-oh. Shinojo, did you honestly think that... What? No, I, uh, <clears throat> I was just... Clarifying, that's all. I, I would never in my wildest dreams. Uh, <clears throat> you two needn't worry. Please, forget that this ever happened. If my father catches word of it, I alone will be held accountable. Yes, of course. As you wish, my lady. But what will happen if your actions here are discovered, Chisato? Don't fret. My father has always been one to spoil me. The worst he'd do is sentence me to half a day without food or something to that effect. Huh. Paimon never suspected a guy like him could have a soft side. I wish you a safe journey. I'm sure we will meet again. Bye, Chisato! Come now. Quit your staring and let's get moving. We've got goods to shift. Uh, all right. <laughs> oh, poor same. Oh, we are logging the tree. Oh, we're finally on our own way again. Yep. I suppose it's time we find Toma. Now, where did he say he would meet us again? Oh, right, Kamori Tea House. We are finally free, guys. To explore this. Okay. Ooh, hello, shiny thing. With this. Okay, guys, this was how much I gonna call him now. I mean, I gonna record after, but I gonna explore just a little, or just get there. So, hope you enjoyed this video, and see you in the next part.